Ben Roethlisberger is going to be out for the whole season. He suffered an elbow injury and he's not coming back. He'll be gone for the rest of the year. Now, I still believe that the Steelers are going to make the playoffs, but it's going to be an uphill battle. They're going to have to rely on their running game and the defense is going to have to play lights out. There is very little margin for error. If the Steelers want to make it to the playoffs, which is still possible in the AFC North, they've got to play great football. They cannot be turnover prone. The defense cannot give up big plays. So if the Steelers defense can hold teams to about 20 points, if the offense can just score a little above, so if they can score about 21, 22 points a game, then they've got a chance to make the playoffs. The AFC North is wide open. They still have a chance to make the playoffs. I believe in their backup quarterback, Rudolph. He can throw, he can fling that ball. They've got great playmakers at wide receiver. They've got Juju Smith-Schuster. They've got Washington. They've also got that tight end, Vance McDonald. So they are loaded offensively. The defense is pretty great too. They've got Hayward. They've got that rookie, Devin Bush, who I'm high on. I'm sold on him, he can play. So they've got great defenders. They've got great talent on the offense. Everything has to come together for them. They have to play well. The good thing with them is there are no distractions on that roster. So they don't have to worry about Antonio Brown demanding the ball and throwing tantrums on the sideline. They don't have to worry about the Lavian Bell holdout hovering over their heads. They still have a chance to make the playoffs as long as it's, they stay focused and they just play all out and play well. They still have a chance to make the playoffs. I believe in this team. In fact, I'm still gonna stand by the fact that they will make the playoffs. They will make the playoffs, and I wouldn't be surprised if they won a few games in the playoffs because they still have enough talent, even without Ben Roethlisberger running the quarterback position. So hopefully he'll get well, hopefully he'll heal up and ready to play again for the, the next season. But unfortunately, he's gonna be out with that elbow injury. Like I said, the Steelers can still make the playoffs. All is not lost. They just have to, to me, they have to rely heavily on the running game and they have to play sound defense. They're gonna be in a lot of close games. So they're gonna be winning a lot of games by maybe two, three points. And that's okay, as long as they're winning. It's gonna be a grind. It's gonna be a ground and pound type thing with Pittsburgh. So I expect James Conner to carry the ball a lot. He's going to be their bell cow running back. He's probably going to average, what, 25, 26 carries a game. They're going to have to control that clock. That's, the, that's their best chance of winning. And then the defense is going to have to force a lot of three and outs. If that happens, then the Steelers will be A-OK -okay and they, make, they can make it to the playoffs. And they can make some noise in the playoffs. They can be one of those playoff slipper teams that people, they, they can sneak up on people and start winning games. And the next thing you know, they're winning the, their divisional games and they might even win the AFC Championship. Who knows? It's football. Anything is possible. So I have to wait and see what they do. I still believe in this team. And they can still make the playoffs. They just have to play sound football and limit the turnovers as much as possible. Thanks for watching. Thanks for listening. You should definitely subscribe to my channel if you have not done so already because I've been making more videos like this and I wouldn't want you to miss out on any of them. So definitely press that red subscribe button be below this video because I wouldn't want you to miss out on anything that I post. Thanks again for watching. Thanks for listening. I hope that all of you have a blessed, wonderful, day.